So, here we are again. A new monitor that I was talking about. Or TFT or LCD. <clears throat> whatever you want to call it. Now this one's a bit different. Nice big screen. I'll get, get me ruler a minute. So you can see the size of it. So there you go, it's about two and a half inches that way. And about two inches that way. Just the screen part I measured. Didn't measure the whole thing. The whole thing is about three and a quarter, about, well, three and a half, I would say, point to point. Looks quite a tidy little thing. As you can see, I bought it for Bofang, but I've never seen one on a bike before, so let's just hope it works when I come to connect it. And I don't know whether you can read it from there, whether it's clear enough. But basically, it looks like Smart, product name LCD display, model number B02N. Dash U, 12 volt to 60 volt. Yeah, so be a bit different. It's got the website, the website of the uh, maker there. If you want to go and take a look yourself, I'll put a link to the description and everything in it. So as you can, uh, in the description, sorry, so as you can see it. But it's www.huiye. Dot com but yeah i've been on their uh, site and looks like they've got some quite smart controllers on there now the one i actually ordered shouldn't have come with the usb here so that's going to be interesting in itself Let's see if i can open it and look at that it's an actual USB-C for a USB-C connector and I think it's a pass-through to like charge your phone or whatever you want to charge off of it don't know about the arm pitching that I'll try and find out as much as I possibly can on it for you so it should be interesting I'm gonna fit it to the bike later today and uh, yeah, and we'll see what it's like when it's all fired up and everything. You have an email. And there's that damn email again. So yeah. So anyway, let's uh, go on and get it put on the bike, and fire it up, and I'll see what I can uh, find out about it see see everything see if it works basically catch you in a minute okay so here it is installed <clears throat> now I've got no chain on it so I'm definitely going to pick up an error I should imagine so here we go Let's see what it looks like. I'll try and get it out of that light if I can. Let's see. And there you go. So, does it work if I touch the floor? nothing there let's give it some vibe levels there you go and there you go error 21 and i think error 21 is the other the um you know the fact that the speed is not being picked up hopefully let's have a look let's see if there's some other settings here Ah, now look at that. Right, so we've got display settings. Let's go in.
Okay, not sure what's going on with my GoPro at the minute, but uh, just try and get through this. So here you go. So you've got the Imperial Metric, Auto Off, I've set the nine minutes. Trip reset, no. Brightness levels. You got three brightness, 30, 50, 75, and 100%. That's your speed of bike levels. Oh, perhaps it's not. Because I think boost, yeah, boost is picking your like electric gears. I uh, usually have mine set to five anyway. And so what is that then? I'm not sure. Perhaps it's for Bluetooth. I'm not sure, so I'm I'm just gonna leave it. Right, let's go back. That's just the display settings. And you've got information, wheel size. And look, you got snow there. But I noticed I did pick snow, but it comes up as the other one. Still says 27.5. And I think for a fat bike, you should select 29, if I'm correct. But uh, I'll have to look that one up. Display info. I guess that just means what it is. Can't do nothing with that. Oh, and there's that email again. Battery info. Probably won't show nothing because there's no third wire. Next page. It's just cycles and all that. I guess that's just if you've got, got the thing. Next page. Yeah. Next page and nothing. So we go back. 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 And error codes. Which is cool, you can actually clear them off of here. So I can hit clear, and when I go back, that'll be done. Go back, and then you've got your languages, and then you've got themes a blue theme. I guess the theme is just for this because it doesn't seem like the monitor actually changed. On the bit, there's your password. Oh, that's Bluetooth there. Oh, I see. So oh, that's quite cool. So you can just scan that, and away you go. And there's your factory reset. And exit. Ah, the error code is still there. Oh, I guess if I turn it off and turn it on again, it'll work. But yeah. I am quite happy with that. It's such a clear screen. I don't know where it's coming out very well on here. But yeah, and it all works. So I'm really happy with it. My battery is 100% and it's showing 100%. So basically the next thing to do for this is, like, you know, get the rest of the bike up together and uh, go from there. So yeah, I'm quite happy. So they definitely work then with the with a bowfang so should be interesting time anyway hope you like what you see make sure you click like and uh, give it a share and subscribe and get others to subscribe let's get more on the channel but the more info I get from people questions and telling me stuff that I don't know would be good help me along the way but yeah, very interested. Stay safe out there. Get out and ride.